today's video, I'm going to be trying out donuts from this shop called Mellow. It's a local donut shop here in Vancouver and I actually had a hell of a time getting it today. So let's start from the beginning. So today we're gonna go buy donuts we're gonna, and yes. we're gonna shower it with you. <laughs> we're gonna shower it with you guys. We're gonna shower the taste. I Is that Maluma? <laughs> Uma Luma. <laughs> yeah, Maluma opened a restaurant here. No, Maluma's mine. No, he's not yours. So all the donuts are gone. And it's only 12. Oh no. It's not looking too good. This place is always busy. Found some donuts. They didn't have any donuts left. However, they did have this. <laughs> this beautiful uh, black sesame cream brioche donut. I'm gonna eat this right now. Yeah, girl, eat that. <laughs> it's good. It's heavenly. I don't know what it is about their cream, but it's good. The dough is really airy, too. Nothing inside, just a plain old donut with a uh, cookies and cream topping. Crispy and fluffy. As you can see, I already devoured the other two in the car, and there's four more flavors here that I want to try. I got two strawberries and cream. This is lemon curd, vanilla, and chocolate pudding. I'm gonna share the other half. I'm gonna have to cut it in half. Yikes. I'm ruining the prettiness, but the first one I'm going to try is the vanilla bean. So this is real vanilla bean. I don't know if you can see the uh, vanilla bean pieces. Mmm. I don't know what it is about their cream, but you can taste the realness of it. This one's really light. This is more of like a pudding texture compared to the strawberries and cream filling. That's more like a whipped cream. This is so good. What I like about their donuts too is that you can see that it's um, it has a very light um, flaky layer of the crispy part and it's Fluffy in the insides. It's rich. You don't feel sick after eating one, like compared to donuts from Krispy Kreme, like those chain donut stores, Tim Hortons, Dunkin' Donuts. This one tastes more like artisan and real. I like that this is very simple and just a classic. All of the donuts are topped with sugar. So it's sweet, but not like sickly sweet. You don't feel disgusting after. Well, I might feel disgusting later on, but so far, I'm good. The next donut we're gonna try, which I ruined, is the strawberries and cream brioche donut. So this is actually the exact same filling as the sesame donut that I had earlier. Honestly, the bun of the sesame one did not taste, like there was no hint of sesame flavor at all, which I didn't mind, but I was kind of excited to taste the combination, but it honestly just tasted like the regular brioche bun with, with a darker color. That's about it. But their cream is just, oh, I can't get enough of it. It's so good. I'm excited for this chocolate pudding. They had a Nutella one too, but I'm not the biggest fan of Nutella. So I just got the chocolate pudding. How do I tackle this? Mm. It tastes like a classic chocolatey, almost like nostalgic. You know those like chocolate puddings you got in elementary school? But like a more elevated version of that. that mm. This one's good. Uh, not my favorite so far.
All right, so we're on our last flavor for today. This is the lemon curd. Let's try the filling first. It's not too sour. It almost has like an eggy taste. I don't know if I'm like in love with it, but yeah, the filling's kind of eggy tasting, but again, I'm like obsessed with the bread, the donut part um, that it's not bothering me too much, but I usually love lemon custard, but I'm sorry, this one's, I don't know if it's like a bad batch, but it tastes really eggy. Like the texture is good. It's not too, like it's not chunky. It's just a smooth lemon curd. Yeah, not my favorite. I think I am donated out. The winner is, I'm in between the vanilla bean and the strawberries and cream. I'm really obsessed with the whipped cream, so I'm gonna choose this as the winner. Mm, this is the best one, I think. I hope you guys enjoyed this food video. Check out Mellow. They have really good service there and the donuts are good and support a local business. Definitely worth a try if you're in the Vancouver area or if you're coming here as a tourist. Just make sure to pre-order or call ahead of time to make sure that they have donuts available and I think you'll be good. I hope you guys enjoyed this food video and if you guys like this video, please click the like button and subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you guys in my next video.